good morning. Um, I realize I haven't really put my face in the emails lately and uh, I think it's important that you know that I'm still here and uh, I'm a real person who is uh, developing these lessons and things for you and um, I just got home from the gym and while I was at the gym I'm like okay you, you can't go and get yourself all dolled up and everything and, and think that that's going to make your video better. Just go and say what you have to say and get people excited because you're excited. So um, one of the things I realized is that uh, I started going back to the gym maybe two months ago now and all I could do at first was just walk on the treadmill. I hadn't been working out in so long that I had lost my endurance. I had gained a bunch of weight and I was just so unhappy with myself. But um, the best Thing that happened was the first day that I had a meeting with the trainer. Um, you know, he did the BMI test and he was looking at like my body fat content and all that. And he gets out this little chart and he says, How old are you? And you know, where your height and everything. And he looks at the chart and he goes, Oh, you're right where you need to be. And I almost burst into tears because I had fallen off the workout wagon <laughs> for so long that I didn't think that I was ever going to get back into shape. Um, but the that was so like such a huge relief to have him say you are exactly where you need to be. And from there on, I just, you know, allowed the incremental progress to start taking place. Uh, went from just being able to uh, go on the treadmill for a little while to lifting weights. I've got a trainer and uh, I got back today and I realized that I had been on a machine that was used to kill me. You know, I couldn't do it for more than 30 seconds and I was on it for two minutes now without even um, really, uh, you know, breaking a sweat and getting, you know, all <laughs> out of breath. So the great part about um, getting back into something after a long time is that you have to allow yourself that, you know, that little bit of time to pick up the pace, to get back to where you were, uh, to get your body motivated again. And, and now, uh, you know, this morning I had to take my son to school early, did not want to crawl back into bed. I wanted to get to the gym and get my workout in. And I, I want to do the same for you with drawing and sketching and improving your painting skills. Uh, wherever you are right now is perfectly fine. That's exactly where you need to be. And when you have a goal, um, whether you want to work on just your drawing skills or increase your ability to make interesting marks or you want to create a better sense of realism or you want to take what you think are very good drawing skills and start moving them into the realm of painting um, or another media, that's the first step is to identify what you want. I knew I wanted to feel better every day. I knew I wanted to have more energy. I wanted to fit back into the clothes that I miss wearing. And when I had that want, I knew where I had to go. And so that's what I want you to think about is what is your want with your work? And then let's figure out how we get to that. And, and it's gonna be some discipline. And here's the other part that I'm really excited about, which I've, I've never done before, which is have a personal trainer. Um, I meet with her once a week for 30 minutes. And in that 30 minutes, not only is she pushing me and believing in me, but she's showing me what I'm capable of. She's putting the heavier weights in my hand. She's making me do machines I didn't even know I could do. And then for the whole week after that, while I'm just working out independently, I'm incorporating that into my daily routine. And I get excited about these little, you know, little incremental things that I'm working on. Um, so, you know, it doesn't take three or four hours every day. It doesn't take going to a studio and being there for four or five hours with somebody who's, you know, trying to get to all 15 students in their four hour period. It just takes these small, short, um, incremental lessons that you can implement every day and get in a new habit and reach your goal. Um, I'm so excited that you've all been reading the emails and sending me such kind notes and getting excited about uh, Sketch Satura being launched. Um, hope it's not too difficult of a name. <laughs> I like it because it's kind of fun and it almost sounds like some kind of weird artistic superhero, but <laughs> uh, but that's just me. So anyway, uh, wherever you are is exactly where you need to be. I can't wait to help you get to your next level. Um, it's going to be a really, really fun adventure. Thanks so much. Have a great Monday.